Hey, Jackson, this this is TJ. Can I just share something with you real quick? You have two yeah, favorite teams. Dallas Cowboys lost to the 49ers. That was it, Jackson. Are you really about to do this? I'm about to give him some <laughs> life lessons. What you're about to do. You don't know what I'm about to do yet. Let me just say, talk oh, no. to my man Jackson, you who's 11. Jackson, you have two favorite football teams, right? Yeah. Okay, so when you get older, there are going to be people who are going to try to like talk bad about you and say that you can't have two favorites. and They're going to tell you everything. Don't listen to them. If those are your two favorites, man, you stick with those two. You, you picked them up when you were a little kid. And don't ever let anyone tell you you can't have two favorite teams, And, man. you know, Jackson, right? when you grow you keep up. rooting for them. When you grow up, you're also going to find out that there are adults who have their own problems who use 11-year-olds <laughs> as a way to passive-aggressively talk to their friends. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. You're, you're actually you're actually today years old for he, that. He, he understands what My that bad. meant. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Jackson, thank you for the call. Call back, yep. okay? Thank you. See you, buddy. <laughs> How dare you? See, there and another, you, another question of Rich Eisen taking something that was meant to be America, innocent and now of, flipping it into something weird. Like, I'm telling the kid that at some point, people are probably going to try to tell you you can't have two favorite teams. Don't listen to him. That's all I said to the kid. But he's yeah, 11. Yeah. You're, he's 11. You're a grown smart, man. Maybe. But it don't matter. How old do you think I was when I start liking these teams? What yeah, point? but then you grow out of it. Right. Yeah, and that's my point, Rich. Sure. You, you evolve. You evolve. Yeah, but that's the point. I, people like you who tell him he can't have them, I'm telling him don't listen to them. Did if you I like say them. he can't have them? Did no, I tell the 11 year old I thought that was adorable? You're telling me I can't. You, again, and then you put your again, a classic business. case of you taking something meant to be innocent and fun and flipping it into something that it completely wasn't meant to be. No, I'm Team Rich on this. Thank of course you. you would be. <laughs> Thank you. No, no what do you mean? Of course. I always have your back. No, that's not exactly true. Not when it comes to teams. No, it's not exactly true true but okay whatever wow. just let's walk through this just a little bit here <laughs> walk through it like again you know you, now you you know me for a long time okay wow. how delighted i am i when i hear a voice like that calling into the show i think we all were Extremely delighted Extremely delighted 11 year old boy who's a big josh allen fan because he's in wyoming and he talks about dusty in pennsylvania as his dad i don't and think he has two favorite teams he likes he said josh his dad's allen. a 49er and he's a josh allen fan yeah, so he's he like the bills, bills and he likes the niners right so later on in life if he's like i love the bills and i love the niners and people are like how do you love the bills you're from wyoming mm -hmm. well wyoming i get it but fine <laughs> but be that as it may and then we're making fun of you for having multiple teams okay uh, okay okay and right. I, what, we, do we do that yeah well, and what fine. i tried to share with him was some was a quick piece of life lesson like you have these two teams love them don't ever let someone tell you you can't like both of them that's all i was trying to tell him and again you flipped it in the me saying or me passively aggressively talking coming to at you. Us I, will, an I won't be passive aggressive talking to you. I'll be very aggressive and I'll address you both. But I wasn't. I was trying to talk to him and be like, look, that's cool that you have two teams. Don't ever let anybody tell you you can't like more than one team. That was it. Well, it's cool that he has two teams because he's 11. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and so when he's 25, he still won't like the both of them? Let's, let's call up Jackson again, and we'll do a math. We'll do a math question. We'll do a math question. If you're 11, and TJ, how old are you now, TJ? It's not the point. Again, See, we're even talking about it. You, it. No, it's just like, again, and you, TJ, you, and TJ, you are the king of taking something and, and, TJ and uh, making is, a mountain. Rich making a mountain out of a molehill. You're 11. Eisen. TJ is 44. We could have let this, we could have let this go like 10 minutes ago, but we're going to keep how? going. He won't be able to answer that. Just like he's 11, doesn't know what passive aggressive means. My, son, that my son who's 10 would get that right. I'm sure Jackson's school out there in Wyoming is very, very good at teaching uh, math and life lessons that perhaps he just learned. He sounded smarter than me, so well, I'm sure I mean, he can do it. That, yeah. Well, we, we've seen some of your body art. You know, you've made bad decisions. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> Bomani Jones in hour number two. Bomani Jones in hour number like two. That filler. Great job, guys. Sorry, sorry, Jay. Great job, guys. It's okay. There was a very nice moment and it had to be ruined. <laughs> very good. Did, did we ruin that poor kid's nice phone call? Not I, thought, I think he might have been confused hanging up. All right. <laughs> Honestly, you could have waited till he hung up and then said to us, you know, poor, poor Jackson. But it Jackson. wasn't a message for you. It was a message for, for my man Jackson in Wyoming. To grow up in life as, a, as a, he's happy about his bills. Yeah, and, stay, and, and to stay. Oh, why do I have to keep explaining this? I think that was pretty self-explanatory. Okay. But, right. you know, hey, maybe I'm wrong again. But you have only one NFL team, though, right? Yeah. Okay. So why didn't you ever have a second NFL team? 
I never wanted one. Why did you want a second um, well, football is basketball six, team? Because football is 16 at the time, 16 weeks out okay. of the year. So why did you want a second basketball team? Because I lived in Pennsylvania. Yes. I grew up loving the Sixers. Yes. Moved here, I moved right? here. I lived here for 20 years, and I adopted the Clippers. That makes sense. Why? The Sixers does, it doesn't so give I you should, enough? So should I just not root for a team I think, I think when I'm spending? Because they're in different conferences. I, the I'm spending hard-earned like, money to buy like Clippers tickets. That's the, that's the the, different college teams? Yeah, that's it? weird to me, but whatever. I, I'm done talking about the teams with him. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get an eight-year-old here to moderate this thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, he, it, it's obviously he gets very defensive about it, so it's like it, makes, right, for, it makes awkward radio, so I'm kind of over it. Like, this could be, if this was like real sports right now, okay, I'll Gla- do Glasses, notebook. I'll do br- uh, my notebook, and I'll just be like Brian Gumbel. Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> like, like Molly on first take. And we'll leave it there. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.